Okay. Excellent. So now, are you all ready? Yes. yes? Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay, blank, I go to the party. Excellent. So, everyone answered correctly. Very good. Now, let's continue to the next one. Okay, blank, you pass me the salt, please. Do we have to wait? Yes, I think so. All right, excellent. Could you pass me the salt, please? Okay, let's continue. All right, number four. Could we stay out until midnight? Okay, I'm going to answer incorrectly, so, okay, that's what I need to do. All right, so how many? Uh-huh. Okay, so this one is interesting, okay? No, you can't. Mm -hmm. All right, let's continue. Okay, next. May I go to the toilet? <laughs> okay, so in this case, both are correct, okay? Yes, you may, or? Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Okay, next. Is this correct? I can, he can, she can. Oh, my time is up. Okay. Yes, it's correct. Next, number seven. Is this correct? I can, he can's, she can's. Excellent. No, it is incorrect. Okay. All right, then number eight, which is correct? Okay, the correct answer is, could we go outside? Excellent. Okay, tell John the film starts at 6 p.m. Ask him if he, blank, get there in time. Excellent. The correct answer is can. Okay, Monse is on top. Very good. 
Okay, 10 out of 11. Could I sleep over at Jamie's tonight? Okay, yes, of course you can. All right. And Dioema is now on top. Very good, Dioema. And, and I'm on fire. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> they, put yes the, they put the flame up there. <laughs> That's so Absolutely. nice. Absolutely. All right. So now this is the last question. Can you lend me a pen? Very good. The correct answer is yes I, yes, I can. Can you, can you lend me a pen? Yes, I can. Okay, very good. So now we'll see who's the winner. Okay, Shan is on third place. Monse second. <laughs> and Dioema do two. <laughs> is <laughs> on first place and of course robert the <laughs> i love i love the dance <laughs> <laughs> okay so that was just a little competition nothing to worry about okay no because we're today, playing it's and it's not... so late to be competitive i know <laughs> <laughs> okay so today's objective is the following Students will learn how to use the words can, could, and may to make polite requests, okay? Mm -hmm. All right. So can, could, or may. We're going to watch this video, okay? And I want you to think about or pay attention on when do we use can, could, or may? And what's the main difference between between them? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah. Correct. Okay. So you can write the question. Okay. So oh, it's going to be here anyways. Okay. But pay attention to the video. Okay. All right. Are you ready? Yes. Yes. Okay. The use of can, could, may for offer, permission, request. We can use can, could, or may to offer something, ask for permission, or request something from someone. But you may be asking yourself, what's the difference then? The difference is quite simple, the level of formality. Can is considered informal. Could is quite neutral. And may is a bit more formal. Got it? Here are some examples. Can I carry the box for you?
could you please close the gate? May I ask you a question? Mom, can I go out? It's such a beautiful day. Could you send me your CV? May I get you a drink? And so on. Please subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to like and share. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Okay, very good. So, when do we use can, could, or may? Raise your hand. Yes, Tio Emma. You can use can, could, or may in, the, in different ways to say, to take uh, some permission or some, uh, petition to, to, the, to other people. No? Okay. They have different to, rates. Uh -huh. To ask permission. To ask permission. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Very good. Or, um, or to take a special request for other people. Exactly. Okay. Mm -hmm. And also to offer, right? Mm -hmm. To ask offer. for an offer. Okay. Excellent. And what's the main difference between them? between can, could, or may? Uh, uh, yes, sorry. Chantal? The level of formality. Excellent. Monse, do you remember when we used can, um, talking about the level of formality? Yes, can use informal. Exactly, so can is used for informal situations. Okay, mm -hmm. Jonathan, can, do you remember when we use could? In neutral, neutral form. Neutral formality, right? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. yep. In a neutral situation uh, regarding neutral formality. Situation. Excellent. Yes. And this is for everyone. When do we use may? In what level of formality? Very formal. High level of very formality. Mm -hmm. In a very formal situation. Excellent. Very good. So I see that you paid attention to the video. Excellent. So here we have a summary of this information. Okay, so can, could, or may. The level of formality is the most important thing to note. Okay. Sorry. Um, Chantal, can you read the first one? Can, an example? Yes. Can is usually used in formal situations. Example, when, talk, when talking to family. Okay, used, used. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When talking to family, okay, or to children. It's a, a so the sense when you, use can in a polite question is that it's more, it's closer. The relationship is closer. Mm -hmm. okay. So yeah. And okay, do you have a could and the example, please? Yes, could is a slightly more formal situations. Example, when ordering food in a restaurant, yes. Mm -hmm. So slightly more formal, but not very formal. Okay. Yes. When you request, yes, when you are in a situation, uh, when you're a customer or a client, then mm -hmm. could is a very good word to use for asking something politely. And last one, Jonathan, may, and example, please. May, uh, may much more formal situation. Example, when talking about Talking with uh, to your boss. Exactly. Okay. 
much more formal situations. Talking to your boss is a very good example of it, okay? All right, so do you have any questions so far? No, okay. no. Excellent. So what's the sentence structure, okay? So as we are making requests, the words can, could, and may are all question words. They come at the beginning of the sentences, mm -hmm. okay? Sorry. So we're going to choose which ones to use if we are speaking to the following people, okay? Okay, we're going to choose from can, could, or may. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're talking to a friend. Blank, I lend your book. Can. 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 Can I? Exactly. Can I lend, can I lend your book? The answer is always no, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yes. Okay. Uh, next one. So you are talking to a, a teacher. Blank, I lent a Cult. pencil, please. May. Could. May. I think, yes, I think could or may, depending on the level of formality. Okay. Maybe a university teacher, you are going to say may, may. okay? Uh, but if it's like your teacher from elementary school or something, yes, you surely could, should be enough, okay? Enough formality. So mm -hmm. yes, I think depending on what teacher, if it's me, you can say can, okay? No worries. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. That's nice. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Uh, next one. You are talking to a doctor. Blank, I have a prescription. Hey. Cool. Cold. I think both are acceptable. Again, could or may. Yes. Uh, a doctor to a patient, to a parent. Uh, no, sorry, I, I read patient. Sorry. Uh, okay. So you're talking to a parent. Okay. So you're talking to your mom or your dad. Blank, I can. have some water. Can. Can. can I have some water? Exactly. Can. Okay, so it's very mm -hmm. casual. It's, it's a very close relationship. You don't need formality for that. Okay, uh, next one. To a parent-in-law, Jonathan. Mm. <laughs> Out. May. <laughs> 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 yeah, in, in your depends, case, depends. Jonathan, yes, it obviously it depends, but <laughs> I, I, I use can. Oh, okay, that's great. Good relationship there. No. <laughs> can I use your bathroom? Excellent. Yes, again, it depends. <laughs> and <laughs> last, uh, you're talking to a child. Can. Can. Yes. Can you pass me uh, the pen? Yes, you don't want them. You don't want to scare them by telling, may I pass, may you pass me the pencil? Too formal, too formal. Okay. So yes, this is how you use these words, okay? It's important to note that first you have the modal verb, can, could, or may. Then when it's a question, I have to uh, clarify. Uh, then you have the subject, and then you have the verb, okay? The main verb of your, sent of your question in this case. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And finally, the uh, object. All right. Now let's do another practice. So change the request. Okay, so here we have imperative sentences. For example, go to the supermarket and bring me a cake. So the way this sentence is structured is like an order or a command, okay? What I want to do is to 
change it into a polite request mm -hmm. using can, could, or may. So how can I do that? Using go to the supermarket and bring me a cake. So first, I, yes? Could you, could you go to the supermarket? Exactly. Could you go to the supermarket and bring me a cake? Mm -hmm. And if you want to be very polite, you are going to ask, please, at the end. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You can also place please after the subject, okay? Could you please mm -hmm. okay. go to the supermarket and bring me a cake? So usually you put it at the end. If you put it next to the subject, it sounds uh, stronger, okay? The sense of request is stronger if it's next to the subject. Could you please go to the supermarket and bring me a cake? It's more emphatic. So if you are being just very polite, it's better to just put it at the end of the sentence. Could you go to the supermarket and bring me a cake, please? Okay, very good. So next one. Um, Tio Emma, please read the sentence and then change it to a polite request. Uh, you are muted. Hey. Pass me the newspaper. C could you pass me the newspaper, please? Excellent. Very good. Um, sorry. Where are they? Mm -hmm. Not here. Excellent. One second. Next one. Uh, you are muted too. Did I mute you all or what happened? No, I don't know. No. Mm -mm. I, um... Maybe Roberto can hear us. No, Maybe. yes, I can hear you. Um... Yes. Ah, okay. Uh, so... And you can mute it all if you wanted. Mm -hmm. Monse, uh, you are muted. We can't hear you. Ah, oh, there you are. Okay, and now my my screen went black. Sorry, I'm going to share again. I don't know what happened. Not too baby, Monte. Yes. <laughs> Hi. 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 Welcome to English class. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay, Monse. So. Please read the next one. Yes, bring me the medicine from the pharmacy. Yeah, I think is may you bring may bring may I bring me the medicine from the pharmacy? Uh, it, it is you, okay? Because you okay. are requesting it to someone else. Uh, so may you may you bring you. Bring me the medicine from the pharmacy. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. So that's a very, very polite way to say it. Okay, next mm -hmm. one, Jonathan. Uh, take the tablets. Um, uh, Luis, uh, could you take the tablets, please? Excellent. Could you take the tablets, please? Okay. Very good. Chantel, next one. Mm, can you watch the baby, please? 
Mm -hmm. Excellent. And next one, Tio Emma, you're talking to a stranger mm -hmm. on the street. Help me. Um, me uh, could you help me, please? Exactly. Could you help me, please? Mm -hmm. Okay. It's a neutral oh. situation. You don't need to be too yes. formal. Okay. So extremely good. polite or no? Yes. And can sounds a little bit too informal if it's a stranger. So could mm -hmm. you help me, please? That's perfect. Okay. Um, I call your father, Monse. Uh, can you call your father? Excellent. So probably you're talking to a child. So you tell them, mm -hmm. can you call your father? Mm -hmm. Again. And Chantal, last one, please. You are talking mm -hmm. to your partner, for example, to your boyfriend. Mm. Can you tell me what is wrong? Exactly. Okay. But if it's Without someone you. you don't know, that well or someone at work then you mm -hmm. could you tell me what is wrong mm -hmm. okay all right very good so yes that's how you structure questions using these words okay mm -hmm. okay all right then so please open your books on page 153 okay and go to exercise 44.3. What page is, oh, okay, 140. 153, and uh, the exercise is 44.3. To mark the list. Yes. Jonathan, can you please read the instruction? Uh, yes, teacher. Mm, mark the best reply to each request. All of these replies are correct, but someone are more appropriate for formal or in, in formal situations. Okay. So let's read the example, um, Chantal. Mm, yes. Can I borrow your car, Harry? Uh, no, you can't, Joe. I need it. I need it today. Okay. So as you can see, the answer corresponds to the question. Okay. Mm -hmm. The other answer would be, no, you may not. Okay. But that's a formal way to answer to a question that is not as formal. Okay. So in this case, a better answer is this one. No, you can't, Joe. I need it today. Yes? So mm -hmm. you have to choose yeah. which one corresponds better to the question that is made. Okay, very good. So I'm going to give you four minutes to complete this, and then we'll check together, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay.
I'm finished. Me too. I'm ready. Okay, very good. Uh, Jonathan, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, excellent. All right then, so number one, Chantal. Uh, yes, uh, excuse me, do you know where, excuse me, do you know where the station is? Uh, I choose, I chose, no, I don't. Mm -hmm. mm. I prefer, I'm afraid, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Why, Monsa? Because, because uh, it's, it's more formal mm -hmm. and use the, the ask, no. So I don't know. It's mm -hmm. complete the 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 answer. It's more polite. It's more polite <laughs> to say I'm afraid I don't know. Mm -hmm. yes. Instead of saying I'm just... afraid. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I'm afraid. Uh, what I mean is it's not uh, scary. In this context, is a different meaning. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Afraid means it's a synonym of uh, scared. Okay, but when you say I'm afraid and then you follow that with a statement that has not, nothing to do with fear, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you're implying that it's like saying I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, mm -hmm. yes. I don't know. I'm sorry. Okay. But when you use, I am afraid it's more formal than, than I am sorry, no? Because yes. I'm sorry, can, I can do it with my friends or, or relatives. And I'm afraid it's with that person. It's not too much formal, but it's formal, no? If you are in the street, I am afraid, I don't know, that's a, a polite answer, no? Okay. Yes, it is very polite. Mm -hmm. But both, you can use either. If you see here in the key language mm -hmm. section, okay, here we have the example with, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. So for example, excuse me, could I sit there here, please? And the answer is, Chantal? Uh, I'm sorry, but that seat is taken. Mm -hmm. okay. So instead of telling them, no, you can't sit here, or you can be polite and say, I'm sorry, but that seat is taken. Okay, that's mm -hmm. way that's more right. polite. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And then here we have another example. Um, Monse, can you please read this? Yes, good evening. May I res good evening. May I reserve? Table for say 7 p.m. I'm afraid we are complete full this evening. Completely? Completely full this evening. Okay. It's polite. When, when you say I'm afraid, it's not like oh, I'm afraid. It's more like uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> yes, no. I, it's <laughs> polite. I'm in, polite. I'm in touch. Yes. yes. It's more like I'm in touch with what you're feeling right now or with uh, the frustration you may feeling right now. I'm just being empathetic. So I'm afraid we're completely full this evening. Okay. Uh, other examples would be unfortunately. Okay. 
Mm -hmm. Okay, unfortunately, we're completely full this evening, okay? So mm -hmm. by using this type of expressions, you're making your answer more polite and less direct. Mm -hmm. Okay. So yes, in this case, since the question is very polite and these are probably two strangers, the most correct thing to do is to say, I'm afraid, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, number two, Jonathan. Uh, number two, can we go soon? The show parts at 8 p.m.? Yes, when I finish my coffee. I agree. Mm -hmm. I agree. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Me too. Exactly. So these are two friends. It would be very strange that they answered, I'm afraid that won't be possible. Okay, that's very, very polite. Okay. And number three, uh, Diwayama? Yes. May I suggest we meet we meet in the restaurant at, uh, no, that's not. Yes, yes, that's, that's the number. one. Yes, number. Ah, okay, yes, mm -hmm. yes. May I suggest we meet in the restaurant at 7 p.m.? Yes, that sounds perfect, Mr. Aker. Miss? Miss? Miss, Miss Aker. Elliker. Elliker. I know, I, know. It's, I, I don't see clearly in this screen. Okay, yes. Okay. So Miss, this is. Mm -hmm. This is clearly because May is formal. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And May... you say Miss Miss Aker. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. So here you have to. Yes. This is very formal. Uh, mm -hmm. May. Mm -hmm. So, yes. And number four, Monse. Yes. Could we post postpone our meeting until tomorrow? I'm sorry, but I have meeting all days. It's mm -hmm. uh, I prefer I prefer uh, this because it's neutral, no, no formal, no informal. No. Yes, yes, and this is this seems that is uh, um, this is at, at this is a work environment. So yes, it's better mm -hmm. to be more polite than a, a bland. No, we can't. Mm -hmm. All right, very good. So I see that you understand very well this. Um, here in the key language, you have further examples mm -hmm. on how to use these polite expressions mm -hmm. using can, could, and may, okay? So let's read these other two because this one we already read. Jonathan, can you please read this conversation? Yes. Can I borrow your pen? Sure. He, here you go. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Uh, could, could I have a glass of water? Of course. Mm. Mm hmm Excellent. So this one we already read. Okay. Thank you, Jonathan. Also, also yes. sir. Ah, okay. Um, good evening. May I reserve a table for 7 p.m.? I'm afraid we're completely, but this evening. Completely full. Full this evening. Okay. Okay. So there you have different examples, okay? Now it's time to practice this in a conversation, okay? So for these, we are going mm -hmm. to make, we're going to do an activity, okay? This is our speaking activity task number one. Okay, do you mind, please read the- I'm sorry, uh, but my screen is black. I don't know why. Let oh, me really? a second. Oh, okay. No, I don't no know worries. what it's going to do. Um, I, I think that in, I need to disconnect. Because okay, maybe it's five. I ah, know, I'm here. I get back. Yes, thank you. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. Is, <laughs> okay. is it fixed now? 
Yes, I think so. Okay. Okay. And I can see your. Uh, I don't know. Let me change. They, they can be change the the from the view of the. Yes. Uh, Chantal, Monse, Jonathan, can you see my screen? The slide? Yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes, I, I, yes, I, yes I, can. I can. Yes, I can. I don't know what happened because they changed all the com all the okay. config, all the... Okay, yes, I, I see the screen. If you all want right. to mm -hmm. Yes, the Emma, please. Can you read? Speaking activity cast one. Uh -huh. We are going to role play the different scenarios taking it in turns to be each person of the character. You need to have a conversation with these people, asking questions beginning with can, cool, or may. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes, mm -hmm. is it clear? Mm -hmm. Okay, so here we have different scenarios. Um, mm -hmm. For example, customer and a waiter, okay, at a restaurant. Uh, customer service assistant and a customer. This can be on the mm -hmm. phone, for example, okay? So um, mm. I have a problem with something I ordered from Amazon and I call customer service to, to see what happened, okay? Then, mm -hmm. or we have a family dinner. And then we have another situation with teacher and student. First date, visiting your grandmother, uh, telling your child politely to do their homework, taking a taxi, and finally talking to a wedding or party planner about what you would like. Okay? Mm -hmm. Yes? Do you? Yes. Okay, very good. So one, two, three, four. Are we four this time? Oh, that's perfect. Okay, so Dioema and Jonathan, you are going to work together. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, and Monse and Chantal, you are going to work together as well. All right, so I'm going to uh, share the situations in the chat so you have them there. But you have to decide which situation you are going to develop. Okay. Mm -hmm. And please write a very short dialogue between these two characters, okay? And then you are going to present it to your classmates, okay? You're going to act it out. This is a role play, but I'm gonna give you some time to prepare your lines, okay? Together. So I'm gonna post the situations in the chat. Okay. Can you see them? Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, okay, mm -hmm. very good. So I'm gonna send you into breakout rooms so you uh, prepare your scenes. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Where is it? Hmm. Here it is, okay. Okay, no. Okay, Monse, remember to uh, accept both of your devices. No. Oh. Ah, just. Oh, what happened? Okay, there you are. Yes, uh, just to accept the invitation in both of your devices. And yes. I'm going to send the invitation right now. Okay. Let me know if you have any problem. Okay. 
speak the customer and waitress or oh, okay. family dinner. Yes, customer and waitress. waitress. Yes. Waiter, waiter. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Uh, mm. The restaurant. Mm. Mm. Maybe. Uh, 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 you waiter and I customer or? Which prefer you? you? Okay, I waiter. Which you prefer? Which you prefer? <laughs> I waiter? Okay. <laughs> okay, I uh, waiter. Okay. I'm, okay, I'm custom. Customer. Okay. okay. The restaurant, like a pizzeria. Pizza? Uh, I don't know. Uh, yes. Yes. Pizzeria. Yes. Restaurant. Pizza. Pizza, no? Mm -hmm. Pizza restaurant. Okay. Yes. Pizza restaurant. Um, I don't know. I waiter. Yeah. Ah, you mm -hmm. customer or. Uh -huh. uh, I go to the restaurant and and greetings. Hi, hi, lady. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> hello. Good, uh, okay, good morning. Hello. Welcome. Uh, good morning. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning for you. pizza. Maybe good night. Ah, yes, yes. Good night. Good evening. Yes. Good evening. Yes, yes. Good evening. Good evening. Uh, good evening, Mr. Miss Miss Chantal. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, uh, oh no! Hello, good good evening, and ha hello. What is your name? Or oh, or something to yes. say? Yes, yes. Name, no? Hello. Uh -huh. mm, oh, what what what's your it's your, oh, I don't know. I don't know. Say in the formal way. Uh, ask your name. It's okay. What Hi. is your name? Or este, is this, could, what could, is your name? Could you uh, take me a, a uh, name uh, me, or me. name for reservations? Oh, or, that's a, you could you can use could in that situation. Could you tell me your name? I don't know why a waiter oh, okay. needs their customers' names, honestly, but it's a very good <laughs> uh, opportunity to practice. Could you? Could you tell me your name? Please? Tell me your name. Mm -hmm. Yes, okay. I could. My name is Monsi. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm gonna check on the other ones and I'll be back, okay? Yes. Yeah. Okay. To taste, to taste different preparations, no? Mm -hmm. And also, also the special Special and I don't know how I, I have to the, say, the specialty of the, of the night. The specialty of the night is the plate that we offer. No, I, I yes yes I, I, I know but my, my idea is um, a special uh, meals for for share the, the these drinks you know the, ah, the entries okay. of the okay and, mm -hmm. or, or things like that. Mm -hmm. yeah, you, you can ask what is the food that, that have the best combination with the with the with the mm -hmm. theology, no? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Esto es lo que encontré en la... A ver, no sé por qué está hablando de mí. <laughs> Siri, no? <laughs> no okay, the Siri, uh -huh. and I put some examples for beverage. Okay, yes. And I think that it com what we completed, no? Because I uh -huh. offered the specialty for this. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And where else? Um, Can you ask about desserts? Desserts, ah, yes. The, the best. It is the best, it's the best time of the, of the, of the food. <laughs> desserts, okay. Remember, um, it's dessert. Not, dessert. Uh -huh. not, not a desert. Desert is where snakes and yes cactuses and mm -hmm. live okay uh, 
dessert, 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 okay? not dessert, 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 okay, dessert, okay. I think I think that we have our speech. <laughs> oh, uh, well, are you ready then? Yes, we think. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, would you like to um, read it for me? Yes. Uh, and uh, that's a situation in customer and waiter and the waiter. And I begin in the conversation and I say, can I help you? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, we're practicing. <laughs> yes, please. Practicing. Uh, my, my answer is yes, please. Um, uh, could you uh, share me the, the menu, please? Yes, um, of course. Uh, so sorry. And um, um, what is your uh, specialty about mixology to tonight? Okay. Yes, of course. I, I want to try the menu, and we have uh, we have a, a lot of options uh, tonight with mezcal, with different preparations. Oh, so sounds good. Um, yes, please and. What what other um, su, su, I, how do you say suggestions? Suggestions. 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 Thank you. Su suggestions. 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 Suggestions, suggestions mm -hmm. for um, to, to share with with mezcal uh, things mm -hmm. like that. Um, uh, dessert, desserts. Yes. Mezcal is a, a flexible beverage, and you can you can combine with fish or meat. We have a special fish uh, that we call fish sarandeado. That have, it's a specialty of Oaxaca, and for meat we have a stick, a steak. And for the finish of the of your meal, I suggest can you you can have the best dessert is a pine uh, the pineapple pineapple pie up uh, pineapple. Uh, uh, refresh, refresh that's that's a freeze pineapple with some nuts and and some ice cream the, the <laughs> good good <laughs> it's, it's the best it's the best mix that i i hear uh, yes please all of all of them okay thank you for your okay for your order <laughs> Okay, very good. Um, okay, so I made some notes. So yes, okay. flexible, not flexive. Flexible. Flexible. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. uh, you can say beverage. It's a flexible beverage. Beverage. Bever uh -huh. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And okay. not freeze. Frozen. It's frozen. Fro yes. Frozen as the uh, mm -hmm. yes. That's the adjective. And. Mm -hmm. And you said it's the best. I heard. How did you say it, Jonathan? I heard. Um, I heard. Uh -huh. Is um the the idea is. Um, yes, is 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 the mejor que escuchado or that sounds very good or things like that. Okay, so that um. That's the. Best idea I've, you have to use the present perfect. I've, 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 I've heard, heard, heard and past mm -hmm. participle, heard. okay? That's the best idea I've heard. And you can add an off at the end. I've heard off, okay? Mm -hmm. To make I it more like off. an idiomatic expression. So that's mm -hmm. the best idea I've heard of. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Thank Very you. good. So practice. Only a clear question. Yes, of the... course. Do you have? Oh, yes. Frozen mm -hmm. is adjective and freeze is noun. No, freeze is the would be the verb. The verb. Okay. Mm -hmm. To freeze. Uh huh. To freeze. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Only that's the question. Uh, yeah. Okay. Very good. Thank you. Thank no. You. Uh, we'll be back soon, okay? So I'm gonna check on uh, Chantal and Monse, and then we'll go yes. back. Please practice one more time. Yes. Pepperoni pizza. 
Delicious then, pepperoni pizza. The, and then delicious uh -huh, pepperoni pizza. Okay. Pizza. Hi. Uh, uh, and I, hi. How's it going? Oh, uh, hi. Good. Have you Good. finished? Uh, uh, yes. So, so. I, 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 <laughs> uh huh. In, maybe in a few two minutes. In uh, okay, sure. Okay. 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 Let me know if um, you need anything. Uh, I'm, I'll be here. Okay. Uh, uh, the okay. I answer. Uh, it sounds good. It sounds good. Please, okay, uh, uh, please give me or take me or try me. me is it cool? Cool. Yes, it sounds good. Give it's, me it's no it, this. Oh, uh, bring I me. sound good. It sounds good. Please good. bring me these uh, yeah. dishes. Bring. Okay. Bring me that dishes. I don't know is that or this this dishes. That dishes. That dishes. 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 dishes no. Yes. If, I if, go... it, if it's plural, would be those. Those? If it's, if, it's uh, if they are many dishes, yes, then yes. those. If it's only one, that. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. 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 I uh, repeat. I repeat the yes. sentence. It sounds good. Please bring me those dishes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Yes, I go by your order. Yeah. Finish. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. I'll. It would be better to say I'll get your order. I get. Okay. I will. Get, but you can I, use the contraction. I'll. Okay. I'll. I'll, mm -hmm, I'll, I'll get your get order. Your order. Okay. Okay. Oops. Then. Excellent. So let's go to the main room, okay? Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Hmm. I don't know if Dioema and Jonathan received the oh here it is so okay good they'll be here anytime okay in the meantime you can practice while they're here okay ah, okay okay i i repeat no yes, yes good please. evening um, good evening hi good evening could um, you tell me your name uh, Yes, uh, I could. Yes, I could. My name is Chantal. Uh, I'm sorry, Welcome I'm going to interrupt to you. Mm -hmm. We don't say I could, okay? When you uh, accept yes? or deny a request, mm -hmm. we always use can, okay? Even if the question is with could, you have to answer with can. Yes, I can, mm -hmm. or no, I can't. Even if they ask with could, okay? So that is important, okay. and 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 we'll and we'll. Uh, okay. Okay. So I'm glad you included that because that's important. Okay. Yes, very important. Mm -hmm. okay. Yes. Uh, okay. Good evening. Could you tell me your name? Uh, yes, I can. My name is Chantal. Oh, welcome to the Big Salu Show. Oh, sorry. Uh, I, I'm going to interrupt you again. <laughs> so sorry. Uh, so the Oman and Jonathan are here. So, <laughs> because you get back, of course. <laughs> yes, because yes. you get back. All right, then. But since you are so uh, in the mood or in the zone already, 
I'm going to ask you, Monse and Chantal, to start, please, yes. with your yes. dialogue. All right, then. So whenever, okay. when I say action, you start, OK? Yes. OK. One, okay. two, three, and action. Hi, good, good evening. evening. <laughs> good evening. Could you tell me your name? Uh, yes, I can. My name is Chantal. Oh, Chantal, welcome to the Big Solution. Could you follow me? This is your table. Oh, thank you. Okay. Could you could you give me your coat, please? Oh, sure. Yes. <laughs> this is. <laughs> thank you. Uh, could I take the order? Are you ready? Uh, uh, yes, please. I want to cup the wine and could you give me the menu? Of course. Uh, of course. Uh, take the menu. Could I, uh, well, no, I know. Oh, thanks. <laughs> could I, this is the menu. Uh, could I recommend that the first plate Bolognese spaghetti and then delicious pepperoni pizza? It sounds good. Please bring me those dishes. Of course, I will get your order, Miss Chantal. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's finished. I'm finished. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> excellent. All right. Very good. So, Dioema and Jonathan, I, I want you to note that when Monse asks, could you tell me your name? Uh, Chantal answered, yes, I can. Okay? okay. This is the correct answer. We don't say, yes, I could. Even mm -hmm. if the question is with could. Mm -hmm. You could you answer, I can. Mm -hmm. The answer is always, yes, I can, or no, I can't. But no, we, we don't say, yes, I could, or no, I couldn't. Okay? In this context, at least. All right. Uh, when she asked for your coat, you said, this is, it's uh, the correct phrase we use in this context is here you go. Okay. You can find that mm -hmm. in the key language section as well. Mm -hmm. Here you go. Okay. That's the polite way to, to give someone something they're requesting, an object, a thing. Mm -hmm. Here you go. Uh -huh. Here you go. Okay. Here you go. Mm-hmm. Yes. And you say a glass of wine, okay? Not a cup. It is a glass okay. of wine. A glass, mm -hmm. okay. A glass. okay. Mm -hmm. But very good. Yes. Excellent work. Thank you, Chantal and Monse. That was really nice. Okay, so without any... I think that we don't have time. Oh, really? Two minutes? We have two minutes. Okay, so let's let's see as much as we can from the OMS and Jonathan's scene. Mm -hmm, yes. Okay. Okay. Are you okay. ready? One, yes. two, three, and action. Good night. Can I help you? Yes, please. Uh, could you share me the menu, please? Y yes, of course. I can I can tell you the specialties of the of the night. Uh, yes, please. And uh, what about the special uh, drinks for tonight? Yes, we have a lot of options with mezcal to taste different preparations of, of this beverage. That is so nice because we have salty and sweet combinations. Oh. Oh, sounds, sounds good. Um, um could you uh, refer me uh, um could you refer me the, the special dessert to to combine with them yes I, at first i suggest the the main plate the main plate can be so flexible because because uh, mezcal is a flexible beverage and we can use with meat fish and meat and for the dessert we can use a, um, a pineapple um, sorbet, 
That's a, that's a, a freeze a freeze pineapple with nuts and cream. Well, is is the best uh, I've uh, heard too. <laughs> uh, thank you. I I I would like to order all of them. Okay, you're welcome. <laughs> okay, very good. Bravo. <laughs> Okay, excellent. Thank you. So in this conversation, uh, when he was asking for suggestions, it, mm -hmm. it's a very good opportunity to say something like, may I suggest uh, mezcal okay. with whatever as a question that's very polite and very formal? Or could I suggest the frozen pineapple mm -hmm. pie? Okay. Mm -hmm. That's, or I could suggest, or uh, I may suggest, okay? Also as mm -hmm. a statement, not necessarily as a question. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good, excellent. You all did an excellent job, thank you so much. As usual, we're going to have homework. I'm gonna send you in WhatsApp the exercise you are going to answer for next class. And thank you so much, everyone. And have have a good night. Thank oh, you. Thank you. No, thank you for you, Roberto. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Goodbye. Good night, Goodbye. guys. Bye. 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 -bye. <laughs>